All right, so this will be a little bit of helpful advice, a little bit of a guide to the through the floorboards uh, campaign over on Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Uh, looking on the leaderboards, there's only 16 of us that have cleared out this mission successfully with three skulls. Uh, four minutes is the target, and several, from what I've seen, several have gotten very, very close. So uh, we're going to be doing this just uh, for this to be available and uh, hoping for this to be helpful to everyone else. Uh, we'll be having the score boost, uh, skill shot, and multi ball upgrade. But the uh, skill shot, you can have substitute for any of the other powers if you so wish. But let's see if we can hit the four minute mark with the power ups and uh, maybe even ex excel beyond. A few miles outside of Austin, Texas, five youths were attacked in a grisly and gruesome fashion by an unidentified madman. So we have 60 seconds to build up the score as much as we can. We can still build up as time progresses, but the bleed will start amplifying after that time lapses. Um, but now a few potential strategies to go for on this table. We can go for Melody at the Spinner. We could also potentially go for Bloodbath as an alternative, but that takes a little while to go for. You really want to have a successful Melody multi-ball and have another main mode ready to go alongside that. But uh, if you can get the jackpot up enough and you do well enough in the main modes, you should have enough points to get over that four minute mark and get that third skull. The skill shot can be critical during the first few shots as well. So if we miss, that's, that's fine too. We can just go for right for melody. Or we can just. House ball. Welcome Say to pinball. You know Say you know what you did to my friends. <laughs> Completing the lanes hey, can man. also be a help. You okay. Or you can just hit uh, Rector. You hear me? Uh, that works. <laughs> All right, right, right in the multi ball, just like that. I want to keep hitting the chainsaw as much as we can. I'm gonna try and use as much of the score boost as we can. Catching the spinner, on the other hand, is a little bit of a trickier story. That works. If you're consistent on making that chainsaw ramp, you're gonna be good. If you're consistent not hitting anything else, then uh, it just only increases the jackpot value. I mean, that works. It still keeps the chainsaw revved. Still keeps the chainsaw revved. It pulled the flipper. Really, it's all a matter of just keeping the ball alive and keeping multi-ball in session for as long as you can. Oh, that works. <laughs> I 
Very good. Out of the multi ball. We're going to be going for Richter next. At this rate, scoring multipliers don't really matter as much. We're going to try and hit Richter and the moving head as much as we can so we can get uh, a good jackpot. I might be out of time before the timer truly runs out, so you never know. Ah, uh, it's a little bit. Excellent score. But still, first try. Four minutes, eight seconds. That's nowhere near my, or really close with, uh, we were like three seconds off of our personal best, but still. If you can maintain Melody Multi Ball or even just go for Bloodbath on the boss, uh, you'll be able to reach that four minute marker uh, as few, hopefully, as few attempts as possible. Hopefully, this will end up helping out with your quest to the third skull. You can always. You can always also aim for upgrading your powers. I'm not even at full power for distance or bumpers or anything like that. Not even for score boost. But even just sheer practice and getting those power ups maxed out can help you out big time. <laughs> 